Hey, what's up with you guys? A quick update on the uniswap.com uh, features. I just launched a new feature, which I hope you're gonna like, uh, which is the charting feature. So basically, so where we are. So first off, let's uh, zoom out a little bit. So we are in uniswap.com. It allows you to uh, track your liquidity as a platform to uh, uh, manage your liquidity investment in Uniswap. Now, basically, if you're familiar with the tool, which by the way is free if you're if you're not, you come here and you see the different uh, addresses where you invested in. Now, here is an example one. You see the pools as usual, where you invested in, for example, Ethereum Maker, Ethereum uh, BNT. Now you click and what you're gonna see is the uh, chart of your investment over time. Now, what you see by default is essentially uh, the visualization in US dollars. And you see essentially two components. Now, first component is uh, the value of your investment, value if, of your assets, if they were outside of Uniswap, um, so the value of investing, if you held them, and then the part specifically related to Uniswap. Now, this Uniswap uh, yield, which I can isolate. So if you click on one of the line, you can essentially remove it I'll lie on, on only the other. So for example, here I can see the Uniswap yield. Now, it, this is the sum of two components, as you guys know. One is the fee, right? The, the effect of the fee, and the other one is the effect of the impermanent loss. So now, since probably Ethereum and BNT over this period of time, since the 27th of uh, June, probably we're, I mean, didn't have any uh, significant price discrepancy between each other. It's a pretty uh, strong line, uh, which is uh, pretty monotonic, uh, meaning like the fees were always accumulated. Uh, but it could theoretically go up and down also uh, because it's the effect of the fees, which are always positive, and the impermanent loss, which is negative. And then the gray portion is really uh, the, the, you know, the asset as you uh, would have them outside of Uniswap. Now, the sum it gives you uh, the value up here of your investment today. Now, you can see as per any other metrics in the page, uh, everything else stays the same. You see um, the visualization either in dollars or in Ethereum, you can toggle. If you are investing with the idea of accumulating Ethereum, you may want uh, to know whether your Ethereum balance is going up or down. By the way, this is not just the balance in the inside the Uniswap pool, but the entire investment valorized uh, in Ethereum, right? So this is your holdings overall in Ethereum. And by the way, again, you see the uh, ROI of Uniswap in Ethereum. Now, I hope this guy, uh, w this will be uh, helpful for you guys to understand. Another little uh, changes. So I, I've been streamlining a little bit the UI. I know uh, some of you using iPhone have a few problems. If you guys do have problems, write, uh, write to me as usual. By the way, you can find my contacts here and there in the tool, uh, either on Telegram, or you can follow on Twitter. The other thing, I also um, updated a little bit the update mechanism. Um, so that's still a little bit in progress. Uh, but you guys in general, sh even on the free tier, should, be, um, should see an update a little more frequently and um, in general, I, I, I create an algorithm uh, so that the more uh, you as a user come back to the tool, the more frequently uh, your analysis will be updated. So if you want really fresh analysis, don't forget to come back and check them and the tool will classify you as a frequent user will update your analysis more frequently. Um, okay, so that's all for this update. If you um, have feedbacks and like what you see or you have any comments, comments down below or reach me, uh, reach out to me directly. Uh, and uh, yeah, if you like content around DeFi and specifically Uniswap liquidity providing in decentralized exchanges, um, consider subscribing to this channel really, or liking this video really help uh, with the YouTube uh, ranking algorithm. Uh, and uh, yeah, so that's it. Until next time, have a great one guys. Enjoy, enjoy your week.